WVUA's Caitlin Chastain joins us now with the details. Caitlin. That's right. The first fire broke out a little after midnight on High Point Road. I was able to speak with one neighbor who saw the fire last night. It wasn't blaze. All was coming out with smoke. Plenty of smoke. That's what Bobby Burton saw when he stepped outside his home. I went outside the door and then I discovered that two houses down was on fire. Tuscaloosa Fire and Rescue Chief Gene Holcomb says the fire started in the kitchen, but the fire department responded quickly. It has extensive damage, but it's not fully lost. The only resident in the home during the fire broke a window to escape, which Chief Holcomb says was the right thing to do. So we always recommend if you have the opportunity, if you leave your door closed, uh, escape your room through that window. Burton says he's happy no one was injured in the home or out of it. And um, I was just thankful that it, it didn't come over towards our house. He says he takes extra precautions to make sure his home is safe. We turn all the lights off and we also unplug the lamps from the socket and make sure that the stove is off. A routine Chief Holcomb approves of. If you're going to leave the, the kitchen for any amount of time, cut off the eyes, uh, don't leave things cooking on the eye, especially frying and those type of things, uh, and for any amount of time. Now the cause of the fire is still under investigation and there were no major injury, injuries. Live in the newsroom, Caitlin Chastain, WVUA News.